Hey everybody, welcome back. I'm Steve from GraphicDesignerTips.com. Hope you're doing well today. In today's awesome graphic design of the day, number four, I found this brochure cover while I was dropping my cat off to the vet, and uh, it instantly, it was, it was so impactful, I had to talk about it. This is going to be a really quick uh, review, but um, basically... Anything, flyers, posters, brochures, you want to draw people in. You want to make a big impact at first. So, uh, you know, it's a combination of typography and imagery and how they kind of work it in there. And, um, you know, this is a, a brochure for Frontline, which is something that animals take or you give to your animals uh, when they start getting fleas. Trust me, I had them last year and uh, my dog was like infested with fleas. We don't know how it happened. And Frontline, although it's very expensive, it works very well and it gets them out of your house. Uh, so anyway, this brochure was very well put together, just the cover, you know, I'm not going to talk about the whole thing, but, um, something that you can implement into your designs, you know, cause as, as I got closer to it and I realized what it was, I was like, whoa, I was like, this is actually a really pretty good idea. Uh, so let's jump into it. I'll show you what they did and then I'll wrap up at the end. So the message on this is simple. The top message, it says, ever wonder what's behind two little fleas right above it. It shows a picture of two little fleas and if you notice in the background that white texture, it's actually obviously, uh, you know, like a dog's fur, um, which is pretty cool as opposed to, you know, a lot of times we try to, you know, we have this blank canvas and we're like, you know, what can we do? You know, what kind of images can we put on here uh, in the background? Maybe make them transparent, you know, so they're, you know, like a 10% screen of an image just to add, you know, a little bit of character to it. And uh, they did it very well on here because Obviously, they're using white fur. Think about this for a second. If if uh, the fleas, you know, are the dark brown that they are, you, you don't want to put like you know a light, uh, a, a darker color fur. The fact that they use the white fur, it totally made contrast on it, which makes it it more it breaks the whole piece up. It allows you to put the headline up here. Ever wonder what's behind two little fleas? They made that text brown to go along with the fleas. Throw these two little guys up here, and uh, you know right in the middle have this message and then on the bottom where it's light again them you know um to emphasize their product and i guess those three little, little guys are like the uh those are, that's like the frontline fighters or whatever they are i don't know but um i see them on the commercial they're pretty cool so the uh what i like what they did here was like i said the contrast of it and the fact that these are all fleas right here i mean i don't know um how they got this image if they got it perfectly where it's 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 a whole pile and they kind of spread out i'm sure photoshop was used in here to to balance it out because if you look you know from here up there's really you know no fleas and from here down there's no fleas so uh it, it breaks up the piece um as if you were to put a banner in the middle of the piece and the fact that they put they answered the question on the top in the middle with saying generations more you know personally that worries me so I might want to buy Frontline if I'm worried about, you know, my, my uh, dog has fleas or flea seasons coming. So marketing wise, I really like the way that they, uh, you know, the message that they put on here. Graphic design wise, it's, it's awesome to me. All right. So I hope you guys liked learning about this artwork on this brochure. I will definitely, I mean, I implement stuff like this already, but it just conjures up more stuff in my mind, you know, to actually make an entire image on a piece and throw, you know, typography that knocks out from it, you know, um, just to make an impact and, and for people to, you know, see it from far away and want to open it to learn more information. That's what it's all about. So I come out with these videos every week to help you graphic designers out there in, in the world. So hopefully you can implement this stuff in your own work. And make some money or do whatever you're trying to do uh so if you like what you saw definitely like this video comment below let us know how this helped you out hopefully you can implement this in the future and subscribe to our channel click this button right here and you'll get all our updates on all our video series uh every week so i'm steve from graphicdesignertips.com i hope this is helping you all out everybody have a good night peace